Welcome back to White Day, a labyrinth named School Night 6. I don't know how much more of this game we got. I don't know how much more there is. We're almost eight hours in. And I feel like at least three and a half of that is just me dying and redoing things. So. Who knows? Who knows? I'm wearing my Kuon shirt. To channel the energies of an actual good survival horror game. Haters get fucked. Um, and hopefully it brings the right vibes. When we're getting relentlessly chased by Jannies. Remember that survival horror is a force of good in the world. Okay, so what the fuck are we doing? We got a bunch of classrooms, it looks like, on the third floor that we haven't been to, but all of the other main rooms we have been to. Um, okay, so, let me turn this up a little bit. Make sure I'm recording. I am. Okay. So we don't have a beat on where Janny is. Get eyes on the nerd, and that will pretty much dictate what we decide to explore first. He's gone. Sweet. Um, I hope to an early grave. I hope he's truly gone. Um, oh, yeah, dude. Lady Upskirt. Those are some white-ass panties for a corpse. I feel like if you're buried, everything ceases its pure coloration. Okay, so it looks like we have pretty... Where is he? Don't question it. Do not question it. Um, so this is where we ended last time, I believe, was engaging with this room. The door's still open and everything. And I... Okay. Pulled the switch, and I don't think anything happened. Should we check our inventory and see what there is to play with? What does that sound? The sounds don't matter, dude. They're just like drawers in this game. Uh, okay, so documents. Let's see. We did that, and we were greeted by some weird teacher. Maybe that was Sung Chuno? No. All music teachers are dead in this game. Can't be him. We need to get that key somehow. I don't know how, though. We have to do this. We haven't interfaced with this at all. Homeroom 1581012. If the power switch in the electrical room, that's the room right behind us, is turned on while the lights are on for certain classrooms, the light fixtures may blow out. Is that something we want to try? To turn on the lights 1, 5, 8, 10, and 12, and then throw that switch? That might be the ticket, yo. That might be it. I'm down to try that, especially if not if Janny's not around right now, because he would... Man, he would be a nightmare during that. Because he would turn the lights off. So while we somehow have given him the slip, why don't we try to do that real quick? What are these sounds, dude? They're new. One. I guess we should close these doors, too. But what is this thing? Ink ribbon. We have five saves left. Hopefully we don't need them. We did one. One five? Five is... Five is not? Oh, he's right there, dude. No. Well, that was a nice one second of peace. Well, this isn't Spider-Girl. Okay. 
Yeah, we have to be super stealthy. One, five, eight. Eight is upstairs, okay. Dude, already, yo? Should I just do it quickly? Should I just do it quickly? What if this works, yo? One, five, eight, ten. Oh no. I don't know where he is. Is he in that room? 10, 12. Is 12 not spider room? No. I don't care, dude. You kept that light on, dude. Let's go throw the switch, man. If it works, it works, you know? He's still coming. He's still coming. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. No, no! Oh, I fucked up! I fucked up! I fucked up! I was mashing it. I didn't think it would do halfsies. I thought I would mash it and then I would win! Oh. Sing it out, Philly. Sing it out. Okay, well... It seems possible to do. I'll say that much. To like run? And do it? What is it? Just so I don't have to keep opening this. 1, 5, 8, 10, 12. 1, 5, 8, 10, 12. 5 is across the horn. Four. Five. Eight is upstairs. Also, are we certain that these are the senior classrooms? Oh, he's downstairs. He's gonna hear me. He's gonna start turning off lights too. No, I should have closed doors. I should get his attention then, right? Yeah, okay, we got his attention. No, 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 don't turn the lights off. Don't turn the... Notice me, senpai, notice me. That's right. He didn't turn the lights off as far as I can tell of eight. So, I mean, we could, like, try to make as... Keep, like, get as much distance as we possibly can from him. No, we should just do it. We should just do it. I know he's kind of close, but... If we throw the switch, we throw the switch. Yes! Oh! That's the rooftop key, baby! We like that. And it seems as if we have given the nerd the slip. I'm behind a door. You cannot see me. I am fucking invisible. <laughs> I 
I mean, he will see me when he goes to the stairs. Where is he? You think I can crawl to the stairs? Wait, where did the keys fall? I'm gonna hang out in the electrical room, I think. This is pretty dead-endy, though. If we get caught, we get caught, dude. He also really likes the sounds of doors closing. Let's hang out for a moment, shall we? Well, that was nice, huh? Now we can go to the rooftop pool. Pool party time, baby. I forget what's up there. Somebody told me to go there. One of the characters, maybe? Prezzo? Was it Prezzo? Dude, he's taking his sweet ass time, huh? As he does. He's a thorough man. Man, talk about whack-ass video game logic. For that key to be, like, caught in lights. And then just follow some weird cryptic document. It's so weird, dude. He won't come back this way, will he? This is too tucked away. That was so loud, dude. Like, this should be a freaky room in a horror game. Why isn't it? Maybe it's like a little too bright or something? Wait. Nah, even so, it looks a little derpy. It's kind of a derpy room. You know what I mean? It kind of reminds me of the opening notes to the Moonlit Butterfly Fight song in Dark Souls. Even kind of sounds like the same key. I'll have to compare them. The whistling has ceased. Dude, why, dude? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he's so close, dude. There's no reason for him to check in the room, though. Oh no, dude. The music swell. He doesn't know. It sounds like he's whistling on top of me. This game does not do a great job of sound localization. It's really hard to pinpoint sound. The ubiety of sound in this game. Was that the smoking ghost? You're gonna do this now, girl? Where are you? I want to see your pretty face. There she is. Another riveting session of White Day. High octane action. Dude, he's lording over just this floor. What is that, yo? 
I don't want to have to do the turn lights on again thing, but I'm waiting just as long, you know, than it would be just to do it again. Go in that fucking door. Go in it. I think he is. Keep going, dude. Yes! This is fantastic news, everyone. Fantastic news. Now, the key fell... there. We're being quiet. We're being sneaky. We're grabbing keys. Now. I kind of just want to save. Because we have the ink ribbons. Isn't that spider room there? No? There's a save point on fourth floor, and that's where we're going anyway. So. This might wind up perfect and I have a sneaking suspicion that this rooftop pool section is gonna be one of those timed things feels like it's what we've been working towards you know what I mean I'll crouch. You have to respect his insane hearing abilities. Wouldn't be surprised if he was running for me right now. But. Doesn't matter, bitch. Doesn't matter. Slow and steady. We got eyes on the nerd. We don't have eyes on the nerd. We just saved. Who cares? One more upskirt? Where is she? Where is she? Is she gone now? Alright, whatever. Is this right? Dude, did I, like, am I the biggest dumb guy? Is it that door over there? <laughs> Such a weird melody line. What the fuck? Oh, is it from the other side? Oh my god, and I saved... Oh my god. Great messaging game. Great messaging. Yondu Shinmun Go. He could be right next to me, and I wouldn't care, I don't think. Dude, the spider ghost actually went away? Where is he, dude? There he is. It doesn't matter if I crouch, dude. It doesn't matter. We're gonna do it. Oh, we're gonna get displacement wise. He's gonna see us. If he doesn't. Bro.
Wild. Game makes no sense. Okay, so. Close. Close, because I don't like those doors clipping. Maybe I should have just saved again. Who cares? So is this the door up here? Has to be. Thank God. I unlocked it. Ooh, water monster. Pool ghost? Ooh. Sexy, dude. What, dude? What? I can't go anywhere. Who builds? What? Wait, it's just the pool? There's no walkways? Wait, I can just walk on it. Who cares? Whoa. Wait, no. Now I'm doing something. What the shit is happening? I guess I should have healed or something. Or bought a lot of healing items. How did that happen? I don't see her. Oh, there she is. What? Dude, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. You're fine. Oh my god, dude. This chick is out of control. Man, another riveting section of White Day. Seven tranquilizers. Calm as fuck now. Oh my god, dude. Is is there a catch here? Is there a catch? Oh my fucking god. I'm gonna die. He ki she killed me. What's up with the weird ass death scene? We gotta go buy some heals. Because this section... Fucking stupid. Unless there's like an imp invisible path that I'm not acknowledging largely because I don't care. Okay. Where's the nearest vending machine? Oh, okay. You don't have to load the area. Sweet. Do I have coins? I hope so. Snake. Oh, wow. Outside, very cold. <laughs> Once is get it. Once is get it. Okay, three gonna be okay? We're probably out of coins, too. A coin. We'll get a do you, dude. We'll get a do you in honor of Tyon. Being a psychopath. Outside, very cold. Okay, the thing begins. Wait, what, dude? There wasn't even a path to begin with? Oh my god, dude. Cool game. Cool game. So let's look for some tell. 
about there being a walkway. Y'all see anything? Y'all see anything? There she is. There's the cutie. It's a pretty good design, yo. She's freaky. I feel like the trick here should be, like, just keep your eyes on her and stay away from her. God damn it, no, but the trick is some weird, like, you have to recognize some invisible pathway. That there, there's seemingly no tell for. What is this? Here, though. Oh my, f what is it, dude? Like, how stupid is this game? Genuine question. Why, why wouldn't it be at the ladder? Where most people would think to enter a pool. Huh? Huh? God, I'm still so hurt. And we haven't even entered the pool yet. What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong? Oh my god. What am I doing wrong? Okay, let's take a fucking look. I don't see anything. Is it something with the lights? Is it something with the reflection? There she is. What's up? Dude. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna keep going. Can you actually just... And then this takes like... 20 seconds in and of itself. I don't care. I don't care. I don't even have my phone on me. I can't even look it up. What I'm supposed to do. I don't care, dude. I don't fucking care. I don't get how games like this get made. Games are fucking hard to make. I would put them up against any other art form. And I would say making a game is hardest. If you're gonna put so much time and effort and expertise into a thing, why would you make a stinker? What's up, babe? I'm gonna jump right for you, you ready? Catch me. You know what, maybe the solution's actually just in the doc documents and I'm just being inappropriately crass. I think Prezzo told us about the pool originally. Dying message, who cares? I don't even feel like going through them. Okay. Okay. Do I crouch? Is that the idea? Oh. You have to crouch? Well, no. Well, no. But if I keep crouching... Like, what? He's grabbing onto something. This is gonna kill. I'm not even gonna try. Um, 
There has to be a logic to it. There has to be. Maybe I should just go get a bunch of heals. Unless I have them. I kind of assumed I'd have to go buy them again. Maybe not. Okay, backpack. Tranks, baby! I'm gonna go buy the heals. I'm gonna save. And then we'll come back. And we will just brute force our way through whatever... ...moronic behavior this game... ...wants us to exhibit. God, even buying snacks sucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Just make it a list. It's fine. Do you? Did you, did you, did you come clean from the air from the start? A code in fucking Cambria? What the shit? Like some 13 year old Johnny stuff. Okay. So I guess we crawl. I thought we figured it out, team. I thought we figured it out. I thought that was it. I thought that was it, dude. I thought we just had to crawl, and then we were Gucci. I kind of started crawling over here. Dude, I hate this fucking game. I hate this fucking game. I hate it. I hate this fucking game. It makes no sense. Okay, I'm rolling right now. I'm rolling. Why am I rolling right now? So there was like a little black shadow beneath me, but like it was kind of following with me. You know, it didn't seem like indicative of like where to go or something. I don't know, dude. Where is she? She's over there. It does. It feels like it doesn't matter where she is. Oh my god! Like there's an actual like bridge that I'm walking on, but I don't get what it is, dude. Okay, so like. <sighs> Where am I? Straight again? How far can I go until I'm gonna fall? Oh, God. Was anybody hyped about this section in playtesting? Anybody? Oh, my God. There's something I'm not getting. There's something I'm not getting. I should, like, there has to be, maybe if I, dude, maybe if I take out my lighter, that might be it. You know what? I haven't tried that yet. Oh, yeah.
Do you think it's actually just a hidden path and I just have to trial and error it? That can't be it. That can't be it, dude. What's up, babe? Wait, are you disinterested in me right now? There's gotta be a trick. There's gotta be a trick. Oh, goodness. I don't care. I'm looking it up. I don't care. Okay. Okay. We need a thing. We need a thing. Where are we going? So, I mean, it's something that we mildly interfaced with last time, but... Didn't see through to completion. Which is those clocks and those pictures of places around the world. Like this one, we have to use as our baseline. 2 p.m. is our baseline. We have to go to all the other classrooms with these pictures and then articulate them appropriately. So that's what we're going to do. It's going to give us an item. The art studio, one of them? Yeah, Moscow. Okay, we'll look at the dock. And you know, like, the thing is, this could have been, like, articulated to me. And I... forgot about it, or... I don't know. Moscow's plus three, so this has to be 5 p.m. Um, computer lab? Oh yeah, the sound that I hate. We never figured out what to do with this, right? Okay, if you're just gonna make weird sounds, you do you, homie. Uh, Beijing plus eight, so 10 p.m. What is going on right now? Wait, oh man. So was the occult one just right? Naturally? We need those like dousing rods. And apparently they show the way forward. In the pool section. And like, yeah, yeah, like there's totally like my error in like a lot of ways, you know, for not like that wasn't even a possibility in my head. Um, I had just assumed that the boss fight itself would give me the tools to be able to complete the thing. But talk about reasonable in video games. You know, if you can't do a thing, you go get other things. I could help you. A bell that makes a, a clear sound. Oh, these are what I need. These rods. I don't know what that sound bell is. Is he running towards me? Thank God, no. Okay. You know, maybe I'll even save again, just so we don't have to do that. I know I'm kind of wasting our ink ribbons at this point, but in many ways I'm beyond caring. Um,
Yeah, so I again, I don't know how much responsibility to take for not meeting the game where it is in that way. Save in every five in-game minutes. Um, Because, like, on one hand, if you can't figure out what to do, you should go figure out what to do. And you should trust the game to give you the tools or to communicate appropriately that you are missing something or, you like, you need tools or something like that. See, and then he just takes out the thing. It's so weird to me, man. It's so weird to me. So I guess we need to walk when they're straight. Yeah. Okay. A fair horror-y puzzle, you know, to use dowsing rods and the spirit world to navigate forward. Um, move the backtrack. She gonna hit me? She kind of zoomed. She did hit me. We should still have those heals. This takes so long, dude. But a big part of my discomfort with this is that I just trusted that it was possible that this game would just have you jankily amble your way through that. Like, that felt like something this game would do to me as a player, you know? So I'd, I had very little faith in the game design, and that's a problem in, in and of itself. What is happening? All of this feels very wrong to me. You're having me take, like, micro steps. And I don't know if I'm backtracking or what. Yeah, like, this is a decent idea for a thing. What a wild path, dude. Oh, man. That can't just be it, huh? Okay. Um, happy that's over with, but... The whole, the whole thing makes me a little uncomfortable. No, we don't have our heels. Why not? What am I doing? Whatever. Whatever. Die, bitch. Is that our water key that we need? Nice. Who? What? What? He's right there. We need some heals. There's a vending machine right here, I believe. Be okay if we crawl. Second floor, I believe. Oh no, it's not on this floor. And I need to be on the other side. Okay, whatever. I promise I keep touching my nose because of allergies and not because I'm a cokehead. I promise. You believe what you want. I can't control your Johnny Cannon. Nor would I want to.
So there's the vending machine. I guess we'll try for a, a heal if we can get it. We'll have to see where he is in relation to me. Where is he? Is he directly beneath me? We do have to cross this bridge, right? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Alright, we're gonna risk it. I guess it's floor two. Where the water door is. Okay. He should be far enough away where he's not a problem, but... Should make haste! Bally, 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 bally. Bally, 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 bally. Put it in. Nice. Now, where in the heck does this go? Dude, that kind of looks like Prezzo. Anday, Anday. Dude. No, no, you're wrong. Oma. Whoa, you're gonna kick me into some shit? Well, you know I'm going through this door. I'm not going through this door. Dude. I mean, I'm thrilled with what you did to, uh, Janny. Oh, you're so fast. Man. Alright, team. I'm, like, mad open to suggestions. There's no time limit. I'm just dealing with a psycho now. And I honestly thought her getting... the Jannies was going to be more cathartic than it was. But she barely did anything to them. She, like, broke glass in front of them. And, like, what, it spooked them a little bit? I wanted her to, like, slit their throats and watch them bleed out slowly. Oh, is this gonna be a dead end? I ran here accidentally. But it was the thing to do, I guess. You know how this works, nerd. You've done this before. Wait. Did you actually just stab me? Is that a game over? Dude, this game... Just when I think it can't get any dumber, 
it continues to surprise me. Who is this woman? Is she a ghost or is she just a crazy woman? Like... I guess we'll try again. Dude, what the shit? So now we're just gonna start in the red. Delicious, dude. Oh my god, this game is fucking so... I'm not gonna say it anymore. I'm not even gonna say it anymore. You're tired of hearing it. I'm tired of saying it. Super cool piece of music. You think I just needed more time, maybe? Because she was kind of, like, right on my shit. But, like, why even put quick time events if, like... If you're going to succeed them and then... Lose anyway? Did I... Was there another one that I wasn't... Conscious of or something? Dude, oh my god, like what? So like, before, oh my god, if the solution to this is actually that I need to put the fuse in the security alarm before doing this, it's just atrocious game design. I'm trying hard not to be butt here. But hurt here. But hurt here. You know? You know? But it's tough. Let me attempt to conjure some more enthusiasm over my present circumstance. Let's go, bitch. Woohoo! Yeehaw! If it's a chase you want, it's a chase you're gonna get. You didn't find shit, dude. You didn't find shit, bro. Guess who's gonna jump in a pool? You gonna do something about that, too? Can't get me in the pool, bro. Yeehaw. He's really close to me. Pull though, bro. Pull. Oh, you can. How about down here, bit? Whoa, no shit. No shit. I guess I deserve that. Trying to game the game. You're a generally patient person. Give me some tips, okay? Oh my god, dude. Now what? I just have this janky ass save state. What do you want me to do, game? What do you fucking want me to do? If it reloads him, I don't give a shit. Man, I am so confused about that woman. Can we hang out with our singing ghost a little bit? Sing for me, girl. Let me hear it.
Let me hear it, girl. I'm just gonna buy some snacks, okay? I'm just gonna buy some snacks. In building two. How incredible would it be if building two Jenny got me right now? No coins, huh? Do you? You're telling me that my... Stunning. Truly stunning. So they took my... Singing girlfriend. Node Yoja Chingu. And gave me my janitor back. Horror games are supposed to be depressing, but I don't think it's this. This is a different kind of depression. We haven't been in a bathroom stall in a while, people. It's fucking time. Feels like home. Who is that woman with the knife? What if the game never tells us? What if we never find out who that is? I like this one more. I feel like in some sick, twisted way, this makes him go away faster. Wait, he's here now. He's here now. I don't remember what button is crouched. Is it square or is it circle? Oh, me, oh my. Be gone, worm. Be gone. They didn't even make there be enough room. Whatever, dude. Whatever. What do I know about game design? Nothing is the answer. I know nothing about game design. So.
I also know what's annoying as fuck, though. And of that, I am a master. What? Go away. Wait. We got this. We got this. Yes. Yes. Now, all of this is just to try to put the fuse in the security alarm because video games. I miss my model spider girlfriend. I miss her. Where did she go? Isn't she here? Is she upstairs? It's really raining outside. So here's what we're gonna do. Cause our boy cannot do this in a pinch. There you go. How many saves do we have left? Actually. Where, where is it? Man, we still got those damn chocolates. Three. I don't think I care. I don't want to do that again. Okay. Time for Psycho. I wonder if they, like, added the janitors later in development. Like, what if they made this cool-ass game, and then we're like, I don't know, there's, like, no stakes, or just, like, it's a weird exploration game, or it's too short, or something? Because without the janitors, this is a three-hour game, you know? With them, it's eight-plus. I feel emotionally manipulated by this music. Because if I'm supposed to feel like some freaky energy. But I just want it to be over. I just want it to all be over. Let's see if this works. Because if that actually doesn't work, then we gotta figure out some other shit. The fuse is in the right place this time. But why would the security alarm freak her out? Dude! <laughs> oh 
Oh my god! Dude, this game is out of control. Yeah, I'm fine, dude. I don't know, dude. I don't know. She was babbling about her dead daughter. I don't know. Dude, you know what's going on. We have time. Dude, why? You can let me in. Lecture hall? What lecture hall? Dude. Like, I want to talk about what just happened. Where's your body? I want to talk about what just happened. Oh, there she is. But I'm still processing it. What? What, dude? I mean, we should go see what it, what's going on. We should go see what's happening with that. Dude, is Janny back? Bro, she killed you, mate. Oh my god. Just please trigger a cutscene. Please. Okay. Auditorium. Interesting. One of the janitors hurts his leg from an accident a few years ago. He continuously hurts it in the past. An ominous silence is filling the auditorium. Dude, more tranks, dude. I think I know what's actually going on in the school. All of the students are just all high on tranquil tranquilizers all day. That's why shit is so amiss. No, we don't care about a vending machine right now. Whoa, it's big! Oh no. Crazy sounds again. There better not be a janitor. I swear to God, dude. Why can't I go anywhere? What the shit, dude? Fire symbol? What is this? Earth symbol? Can you comment on it just so I feel a little saner? Whatever, dude. The door opens. Dude, here they are. This is where the baseball bats are. Fire safety inspection result. Inspection location, Yandu High School's auditorium. Inspection date, 3-10-2001. Placement of fire extinguishers, total of three. Fire extinguisher, type A. At the back of the auditorium, fire extinguisher, type B. Boys' locker room, first floor. Fire extinguisher, type C. Girls' locker room, first floor. 
sprinkler maintenance inspection. Some pipes are leaking. The sprinkler, sprink, sprinkle, the sprinkler, the, 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 the sprinkler pipe in the green room is leaking and is under repair. The valve handle to the sprinkler will be stored in the storage room until the repair is complete. Okay, so we're going to need all of that, huh? Yeet. That's the one I don't care about. I get down there somehow. Eesh. Wait, that door looks open over there. I see a flashlight, dude. What is going on? This door wasn't open, right? Or am I that stupid? No, I opened this door. I am that stupid. What do I do? We gotta get down there somehow, right? Even if these doors do not open. Okay. Where am I, dude? Anything? I think a locked door has been opened. The machine is going out of control. It looks dangerous. Well, I will trust you with that game. You've killed me for less. Let's see. Boys locker room. Should we check out this fire extinguisher business? Can't go in there yet. All right. Yeah, we're going to need a couple of fire extinguishers. You again. Is she going to chase us again, dude? Oh my fucking god. Whoa. Okay, I won't go that way. Fine. Uh Where where's what do I do, dude? Such cool music, dude. It's like the one thing this game has uniformly gotten correct. What's music? And the sound design is really good, too. We can fit in here, right? Oh, I see it. I see it. Why not, dude? What do you want me to do? We got the snacks. We got the snacks. Okay, obviously not right, Johnny. Ah. Uh... Nothing in here? Why let me come in here? This is the only room you let me come in. This one too. Dude, this vocalist. She's got control. 
Okay. Where's this crazy stabby bitch? Where's that one? Okay, so completely engulfed in flames. I'm assuming that was heat damage. It's all blocked off, yo. What am I supposed to do? So, like, they let us make eye contact. What was it? The girls' locker room? Fire extinguisher? Wait. Dude, I can't go anywheres. Ah. Uh. Back of the auditorium. So I guess that's got to be where we go first. Back of the auditorium. Doesn't seem, you know, possible. Okay, well, if we can, we should get eyes on the fire extinguisher in the back of the auditorium. There? Is it that? That feels crazy. No, open the door. Yeah, weird thing. I don't care. Oh, it's literally just that one. Okay. You would assume that they would... list the fire extinguishers... in a particular order... in that document on purpose. Dude, that's freaky, man. She's freaky. Does she stop chasing me? Oh, and she just goes into the flames. Wild. What is the point of this quick time event? It doesn't amount to anything. Okay, so I guess it's just important to keep in mind that she is in here somewhere, and I guess she's going to try to get me. Yes. Good thing we scoped that out first. What is happening now, dude? Okay, so step one... Got. Now, we should try to make our way to the girls' locker room. Man, her standing in the fire is pretty freaky. Wait, why are you showing me... Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Girls' locker room is... On the left side here. Dude, yeah, her limping through the fire is one of the most effective images of this game yet. Not this way. Like, really freaky. Use the fire extinguisher. Use it, dude! Wait. Nice. What? Oh my god. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess it's still hot. Fair. Things don't immediately cool down because the fire's gone. 
Type C. Electrical fires? Gladly take this. Man, what a creepy shower. There should always be windows and shower rooms. Okay, I guess we'll run to the other side now. What is this? How you feeling, bro? How you doing? How you feeling about all this? Because I'm feeling away, but you've been through more shit than I have. Man, hard uh, music reset. That was rough to hear. Or rough to notice, at least. You gooch. We gooch. Man, he just went and he barehanded that fucking door handle. Like a chad. Nice. Oil-based fires. Well, looks like we can handle pretty much any fire now. See, there's a fucking med kit in the girls' shower room. Nothing in the boys' shower room. What does that say? What does that say? Okay, I have three fire extinguishers now. What should I do about it? Where is she? Oh god, dude, it's terrifying. Uh... It's also a little tough to, like, actually see... ...the icon of when to use? What do we think here? Just, uh... I think we want to try to get to the stage. This fire. Yeah, dude. Moving forward. This is a pretty intense section, yo. Dude, don't hurt me. What? Dude, look at him just fucking barehanding these door handles. Really, dude? Really, dude? Oh my god! Why am I compelled to finish this game? Why am I doing this? We all know that the answer to all of this is not going to be a satisfying one. Oh. I guess stay just way more on top of heels. Like I should drink a do you right now before we even get this shit show on the road. What am I feeling right now? Disheartened? Disheartened doesn't even begin to capture the sensation. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna turn around. We're gonna let her... Wait, she's still... What? Man, that's such a cool image. She just doesn't give a fuck. Alright, so where is the back? So I do want to head this way. Even though she's right to my Migi.
There you are, bitch. Did she get me? It kind of looks like I got got there for a sec. Oh my god, dude. To the other side. Dodge it. Okay. Okay, do you on the bench where all the naked boy butt sweat goes? Let's drink that soy milk. Go ahead and clip that one, I don't care. Alright, to the back of the room. And just know that she's like here. I got hurt by that. Good dodge! Too easy. Piece of cake. Dude, is that the bitch? Oh my god, dude. We gotta give her the slip. We gotta give her the slip. Wait until we... There she is. It's like actually pretty fucking Silent Hilly. That's really great. It is fantastic somatic motion. It's the one thing this game should be proud of. Is that one walking animation. Wait. Point and aim. Oh my god. This vocalist is really capturing my frustration. Oh, Valve, dude. Now, they said something about this. The Valve handle to the sprinkle. To the sprinkle. To the sprink... Sprink... Spunk... The sprinkle. In the green room. We're headed to the green room. Motherfucker. We're heading to the green room, motherfucker. So now we gotta get to the stage somehow. All while avoiding our best friend here. She's gonna get a stab and she didn't. I'm slippery. I'm a slippery one. How do I get to the stage? There's another entrance to the green room. It's this way. Feel like we've been back this way and this room was not accessible and continues to be inaccessible. Wait, I'm in the green room. Oh, okay, cool. Cool. Yeah, baby. Let's finish this shit off. Give it a good twirl. Is she gonna do the same insane like Wah! and just get got again? Or is it specifically security alarms that does her in? Theme song. So cringe. Wow.
Dude, you walking like them Jannies now. Yes. You okay? Don't talk casual casually to me. Yeah, you look just fine. I'll see you. Yeah, I'll find her. I'm sure you get me all right. Likely deserved. Gonna find Prezo, dude. I don't give a shit about her. See ya, bitch. What do I know about tending to ankles, anyway? What I have done I would have exacerbated the problem. Man, I should have saved, huh? Who knows what's to come. Well, that's a new load screen. Ebony. It's 6 a.m.? This better not be the end of the game. I mean, that, I guess that was pretty climactic, right? Yo, so young. What's up, baby? Yeah, definitely. I left her there. Dude, where's Sunga? Don't kaja me. Dissatisfied doesn't even begin to capture it. It doesn't even begin to capture the 12 hours of wasted time. Like, I don't even feel like talking about the game. We obviously got some jank-ass ending. You know, which makes it all even worse. But if I even wanted a small, even unsatisfying answer to what the fuck any of that was, we don't get it. For who knows what fucking reason. Wrong dialogue choices. Dying too many times not doing certain things, not seeing certain ghosts or whatever.
What do we do with games like this? What do we do with the parts of games like this that we love? What do we do with them? I don't know. I don't know, man. There's moments of genuine joy in here, but I can't for a moment say that enduring the rest of it. Look, there's a smooch scene that we'll never get. Enduring all of the absolute treachery that this game can throw at you It's not worth enduring to see what's halfway decent about this thing. And it also sucks too that I kind of feel like there's so much here that we didn't even begin to see. All of the ghost events, all of the ghost stories. Like there's so much esoteric shit here that I feel like I didn't even begin to engage with. Because like how could you? I don't know what like what the game wanted from me most of the time. I'm going to be doing some research, yo. Okay, post credit scene. Okay, it's not really so young. Okay, so bad ending for sure. Wait, could I? Kugo, Gunchanan Ji Baju Sayo. Gunchanan Okay. Oni? I think they mentioned Nayong once. Whoa. So fucking dumb. I got what? I got the ebony ending? Is that what that means? That was the name of the ending? Better have unlocked some dope-ass costume or something. Man, that's just it, huh? Oh my god. Yo, there are so many fucking endings. Oh. Oh, god. Ending collection progress 5%? What are you on about, dude? What you actually want me to... Wait. Wait. There's no way you want me to... Get all of these endings. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 different endings on 5 different difficulties each. Is there a psychopath out there that has done that? Death. Truth. Oh my god, dude. They're tickling my balls with this stuff. Dangerous pleasure. That's the one we want. Faithfulness. No way. Tired of love? Maybe. Wait, I can't even... Click on the last two. Jasmine and Marguerite. Ghost collection. Like, yeah, there's just so much more of this shit to see. 
dude, maybe we do more. How how insane am I for saying that? Like, if we do this, we get dandy guy he, he mean. And that's not nothing. We get biker Dal Susan. Whoever that is. We get solemn memory Yi Pong Gu. And look at all the different shits we can get. Oh man, oh man, oh man, what to do? Well, I know what to do tonight. We stop. I can't believe we rolled credits. And got a shit tier ending. I can believe we got the shit tier ending. That I can believe. People screaming out my window. Okay, here's the deal. I kind of want to do more. So maybe I will. I'm going to look up some stuff. And we'll see if this is something I want to keep playing. There's a huge part of me that kind of does. And there's a huge part of me that wants to suppress all of the memories of this game in its entirety. We'll see. We'll see. Because there is a utopia that I'm kind of hanging my hat on right now that you can play this game in such a way that it winds up being primarily the cool shit. You know, the ghost interactions. And, like, now that we kind of know what to do to get through the game, you know, you could probably beat this game in, like, an hour and a half, you know, just going from point A to point B. We'll have to see the mechanics where in which you actually get different endings and stuff. If anything, we want to try to get the true ending just to see what, like, I'm so dissatisfied right now. With not only the mechanics of the ending and all of that, but... Like, they straight left us with nothing. With nothing! I don't know, team. I don't know. This is a game that just occupies the entirety of the spectrum. It's absolute magic, and it's absolute trash simultaneously. And I don't know what to do about that. Because it's not just like, you know... Think about any other adjacent example. Imagine if... You loved the bass line... On a record. But you hated the vocalist, you hated their lyrics... You hated the guitar work and you hated the drum work, but you loved the bass lines on one record. How often do you listen to that record? You know, it could be the most impressive bass shit of all time, but if everything surrounding it just like irks you in the most uncomfortable of ways, you're never going to put on that record, regardless of how talented that bassist is. I think maybe this game is a little more than that analogy. There's something about this world that I like. And I like it a lot. And it comes from the sound design and the music. It comes from the... I, I don't think I talked about this too much, but I actually really like the character designs. There's something kind of distinct about it. And there's something surprisingly expressive about their body language and their face, facial expressions. And obviously the actor, primarily actress, I suppose, performances were really superb, in Korean at least. Um, the characters themselves were paper thin, you know? We don't know anything about them. And like, uh, they apparently all know what the fuck's going on, and no one decided to key us in. So like, this is where it feels even worthless to, it, to analyze this game right now. Like that woman with the knife that we met tonight. She has a reason for being here. And the game said, you'll never know. And that's so fucking annoying. Like, we don't know anything about this game. 
despite having played it for 12 hours, you know. And that really sucks. It really, really sucks. And, like, I'm going to put a lot of that onus on me, you know. You always have to meet the game where it is, and maybe I just didn't do that. But you shouldn't frustrate me in your game design so thoroughly that doing the things required of me to meet you where you are, that should be a feasible thing. That shouldn't be an arduous endeavor for me as a player. That should be something I want to do is meet you there. My relationship with White Day feels very one-sided. I don't know. I don't know. It occupies this weird space, too, between being, like, feeling hyper-professional and polished while also being the most indie-ass, bullshit, itch.io game that you've ever played. This is just such a confusing... polar game. It's so confusing to me. I guess I'll say this. Not scary. I was hoping this thing was going to be brutal. And outside of some like eerie sound effects and small moments, generally just frustrating. But then again, we didn't like engage with a lot of ghosty stuff. But I think there's a lot of ghosty stuff here. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. If you made it this far, thanks for enduring with me. And I pray for your patience with my impatience. That's selfish of me. Just give me all the hate. It's fine. Okay, that was White Day, a labyrinth named School. I hope you enjoyed at least a little bit of it. So that's pretty much as much as I can say. I enjoyed a little bit of it. So that was one ending. Maybe I'll be back with more. But anyway, have a good night. Peace. Peace.